shooting on a move. The problem when we're walking is that there's a lot of bounce up and down. A lot of schools are teaching stepping heel to toe manner, but that do not provide enough information. So what? Now, in order to be effective in that walking style, we need to understand the principles behind what actually will make it effective. When you're touching the ground with the other foot, we are not transferring the weight immediately on that foot. Actually, we can touch the ground at any point. I can lift that foot from the ground. Then very gradually, I'm going to transfer the weight, gliding the pelvis, trying to keep that pelvis in the plane parallel to the plane of the ground. We call that the stalking cat step. If you step and at the same time, immediately you transfer the weight of the body on that step, you will see a severe bounce. Severe bounce. When you touch the ground first and then gradually transfer the weight, there is no bounce, zero. Zero disturbance in the sides. Touch the ground, transfer the weight. Touch the ground, transfer the weight. It's very important to glide that pelvis in that same plane. Don't create an arc when you're stepping. It's not that. You need to touch the ground, slide and gradually transfer the weight on that foot. Touch the ground, slide your pelvis and gradually transfer the weight on that foot. Stalking cat step. Then we work to gradually increase the pace and the speed of that steps. Touch, slide, touch, slide, touch, slide, touch, slide, touch, slide, touch, slide. Now, uh, with a little bit more practice and repetitions, you'll be able to turn that walk to quite natural. The idea is to ingrain that in a subconscious mind and to apply that style of walking without thinking about it. Now, the good news is that you can develop that without a even single shot fired. There's a one very simple exercise. Uh, take a bottle of water, just flip it, Take your uh, shooting and moving position, extend that bottle in front of the eyes, and now watch the water level when you're applying your technique. The idea is to keep the level, the water level, as stable as possible. Performance Center, the home of reactive shooting science. The second element is seeing what you need to see, and this is where the focal the secret is. Never lose track of where the seed red dot exists at that same focal plane, so I don't have to. Yeah, and the target. 